For 90-year-old Dean Troutman from Northern Peoria. Got my schedule figured out and I don't allow a day off. It's seven days a week. There's no finish line for his charity walk for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital in Tennessee, but a donation goal. And this isn't Troutman's first walk for the hospital, but it will be his last. If these old legs will hold up and the donations continue flowing into St. Jude, I'm going to continue this circle through 16 states and I'll return back home next July or August. Today, making his way through Goodland, Indiana. On the way, meeting his supporters. It's amazing. I don't know that at my age I could do that, um, but I give him much kudos for doing it because it's, it's quite a feat, especially at 90. Dean Troutman has walked through highways, streets, and everything in between, walking about 150 miles so far. And he says he's got thousands to go. The 90-year-old says he'll be walking a total of 3,500 miles, spanning the central and southern United States. He's hoping if it goes national and he gets to complete the whole thing, maybe he'll come up into the uh, $500,000 to a $1 million range, even if he can get the right people. So far, raising $16,000 in 11 days. Troutman says he's got a lot of things he needs to survive in his cart. His most precious cargo, a picture of his late wife, the reason he started his charity walk. He says as long as he can, he'll continue to walk to reach his million dollar goal. If the donations keep pouring in, and my legs hold up, I'm just going to continue walking. In Goodland, Indiana, Yukari Nakayama, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.